Hey everybody, how you doing? Today I'm going to show you how to do show permission for LX students. Uh, by the way, I'm not giving you the answer. Just going to show you how to do it, the process. I think you got me. And I'm going to give you my own examples when you are going to translate it with whatever you want. It's going to be like lifetime learning. I think you got me. Let's start the first question. I think the first question is uh, uh, I'm Betty. Okay. Why they did you want to do that kind of stuff? Let me open some terminal desktop and like the previous uh, project blah 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 uh, directory. Okay, when I press a list, like it's nothing here, it's MPT folder or directory. Okay, like how many so Cal, I think, and it's going to ask you the password, the password of your machine. I think you got the idea. When you press enter, it's blah, empty, because I'm in the uh, like in my local computer. When you work with uh, the remote work, they give you the name and so space the the name of the project. I think the name of the project is uh, the Betty. Okay, let's talk about the next project. The next question is who am I? Who am I? Just like that. When you press enter, it popped up your name. My name is like, you see, its name is Kali. Because my character name is Kali. I'm using Kali Nudix. That's why I name is that kind of stuff. I guess it's boring. Let's pass the next question. What about groups? Groups. I think I missed this pair. Groups. When you press groups, just enter the groups. I think for the LX purpose, you open some VI text, the name of the file, like all zero x uh, something something open it press i then hash back like slash b slash bash and the next answer is groups i think you got the idea but you want to skip out of this kind of stuff press isk button then two point right and quit. It's gonna save you like this kind of bash script. And you're gonna uh, create some like stuff. Okay, like you wanna get uh, create a C file. Why don't you create file? Let's see. Search to create a file like okay. Hello dot C. I'm going to create hello dot C. Okay. Like, uh, I think, include how to write C program. Okay, let's get these steps. Don't say it. open to me not search hello.py. Why don't you create Python file? Like it is the easy one with C's like complicated things. I'm gonna show, I'm gonna give you some tutorials when they start the program. Okay, like print hello. I think yeah. Let's run this program. 
I think the icon is going to change its Python program. Let's execute this kind of stuff because the next question is excuse. I think the for question is MPT touch hello. Then it's going to create that kind of stuff. Then it's going to be executed. When you press ls, it's not executed because the color is white plus ls minus l. It just write and read, not executable. Then how to change that kind of stuff? To change that kind of stuff, ch mode. Ch mode means change mode. U plus x. Then the name of the file. Hello dot file. Okay, let's try it again. Let's change the color. Hello dot pi is changed. Okay. How to run Python? Okay. Dot slash hello dot pi. It just give me some syntax problem because it's working. What about hello dot c? Like gdc hello dot c. When you compile this kind of stuff, it's compiled. Oh, oh my god, c is working. But it's just in pt4, and it doesn't work. I think you got the idea executable mode. What about multi permission? For multi permission, ch mode, ug plus x. That's the name of the file. Hello, dopey. When you press this kind of stuff, if you send this file into GitHub and someone going to download it, it's executable forever. When you press ch mode, you plus x and remove the file, it's going to the, it's going to work. Because the, uh, when you push to the U GitHub and someone come to and clone it into here as local machine, it's going to run it. It's not executable. It's for only for work it for your machine. I think you got the idea. Okay, what about the seventh question for everybody? CH mode for everybody. You go in them plus X, then hello dot pi. It's worked. Yeah, it's worked. It's for executable for everybody and is give you all permission in ls minus ls minus la it give you some kind of stuff it's writable it's executable did you see that but other files are not executable you just read and write you can't execute it this file you can execute it because it's executable we are make it. I think you got the idea. If you have any question, then you can ask me in the comments. I will make you a video. Thank you for watching.